we got the 38 and 24 Phoenix Suns versus the 44 and 19 Wizards. Uh, best team in the East versus what, maybe the third, fourth best team in the West. These are the starting lineups. I- I'm going to have to go with not only do they have the better record and they're currently the best team in the East, they also have home court advantage and they've really been clicking as of late. I'm going to have to go with the Wizards on this. Oh, oh wait, did I? Did I just. There we go. Okay. Give everybody to another presentation. Let's, 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 re, let's redo that. Let's come back another time. Um, this would be right settings, and it would be. It, it would be. Could be gameplay? Yeah. There we go. There we go. Okay. All right. Sorry about that. We have the 38 and 24 Phoenix Suns versus the 44 and 19 Wizards. Granted, uh, you know, the Suns have been phenomenal, and I like the Suns. The Wizards, the number one team in the East, they have the better record. They're playing at home, and they've been really good as of late. I'm going to have to say that the Wizards are probably going to win this. Great to have you with us. We are set to get you over the hump this like Wednesday night with another there, edition center, but, of the NBA but the tip on two K sports. Alongside Hall of Famers Doris this Wizards Burke team and Grant is a, Hill, definitely a small Brian ball team. Tally LaForce on the sideline. But it's the I mean, they use their speed take it on to the their advantage and they focus all so of their look at the entirely on the starting lineup. They shoot it well. Oh, Charles Barkley though, drawing the double. West Unsell with the outside booker, the rotation D there. Here's Nash. He buries it. Somehow Nash was left wide open. What a savvy pass by Devin Booker, making the smart choice. Moving That's the, the thing about this Wizard squad is that because you know Elvin Hayes is only six nine, it's not going to go for uh, West Unsell is only six six, six seven. Ball. You know they pretty much play positions, Nash Nash. right? It, you know if you're going to ask these guys to defend people down low, then you know, John Wall's going to be asked to defend people down low. Gilbert Wall Arenas can look at him doubling Booker with Barkley the immediately. Wow, the inability to counter the vertical and he Devin deserves Booker to be doubled. Up and in. and uh, it's clear they've come out with a game plan. Don't let Barkley beat you. <laughs> you know, literally have it beat anyone else. He, he's been crazy. Almost 28 points per game this season. to get over those screens. You know, so, I mean, time, you know, it, you can't let him get going, right? Because he's the leading scorer. Uh, and he Booker does it down goes. low with ease. So it's like their, their obvious answer is Hayes don't let him reach it. Wall finds Hayes. Ooh, a clear foul uh, there on the and if he does, so he'll get we'll go back on the other end and we'll score. From from beyond the arc. And we'll see if they can match our pace. Yeah, that's the, the Wizards' whole philosophy, right? The first free throw is good. It's like, yeah, you, you might get us on defense, but but can you keep up with us? This is a team that, I mean, when I say they put all their effort on offense, it's both from the strike. You, can you know, they, they lead pretty much every category. Not only do they lead the whole game, it's written all the, over the his body time. language. But their shot percentage. Um, he was the number one team in the league for shot percentage inside and outside. No good on the three. Then the number one team in shot percentage from the free throw line. Their uh, 
Uh, first quarter of ball, almost two and a half minutes in. Uh, they're like, here's Hayes. I believe they're the and number two team the in offensive rebounding. So, I mean, they put all of their effort. Here's Najee on the offensive side of the ball. Knocked away. Ooh. Well, Wes Unseld and, and Elvin Hayes. Here's Nash. Pounded by Beal. Do play defense above and, and beyond. It's good. Fought through contact. Hit the shot. Well, you would think that they would. To the line. Given their size. Shooting for Phoenix. I mean, draped all over him. Charles Barkley's still going to get that to go. And he's going to go to the line. And he's pretty much automatic from there. Charles Barkley having an MVP level season. Washington trailing. As he really has, I mean, Beal from the past couple of seasons, he's just been edged out by Jordan by Washington. and LeBron and James. I mean, he's about three minutes in. LeBron is in that conversation given the Heat's record this year. Here's Nash. Ball covering for three. Booker mm. sends it home from three point land. Booker's got eight um, points. Michael Jordan obviously Their still being Michael Jordan. This run has been tremendous. It's led to a lot of to, good, to clean open looks. You know? Uh, to the wing on the left. But uh, for three, perfect night so far. Barkley has his son's team. We're so accustomed to seeing John Wall work and with the ball. He's doing it, playing a, a fantastic is ready on the catch. game. I mean, with the 10 footer. And all, you know, six of these seasons oh, are ready. hand on it. Second chance effort. The shot by Najee, no good. Uh, no one is really average more than 26 points per game per and season. Again, Washington with a triple. You know, 26 something. It's about in the what the game score does. He's averaging 28. Yes, sir. Outside 28 Booker. plus. And he banks in the layup. He's got 10. Well, they're calling his number time and time again, and he is delivering. To the inside. Oh, he brings it down with a two handed I mean, jam. Wes and he gives up and some Elvin size play inside, way above the size defense. Defense. Well, he's attacking, he's forcing the issue, and that's simply stated a terrific play. Here's Nash. Pounded by Beal. And he lobs it up top. And stolen by Hayes. That was a bad lob. Najee definitely had, had it. Ooh. Big finish by Wall. Had that. Just slashes right past the defender. He Charles Barkley just didn't put in the money. Cover John Wall. The Suns trailing. Getting the ball just directly in Barkley's hands. But they're not it's doing it. They're being the stagnant. Six. And there's a pick. Six seconds Here's left. The three. Fading three is the best shot they can come up with. He probably thought he was going to bury that one. Right now, firing on all cylinders. Yeah, there's a nice move oh. to this <laughs> offense right now. We're talking about a dynamic playmaker with Wes. exceptional vision. Go ahead, John Wall. Here's Nash. Wes Unsung. You need to do him three. like that, Wes. And, the and then look at the rebound, man. Amongst the trees. The They've got a 12-2 run in progress. And he's going for the lob. And the lead increases. What a crazy offensive sequence. Man, the dunk alone would have been incredible, let alone the fact that it came off oh a pinpoint pass. And this is what the Wizards do. It's Booker on Can the way. Can you keep up with us? Knocks down the offense. triple. Okay, this Booker's got 13 now. At 70 plus seven. percent right Getting now. Getting into a nice field. rhythm offensively. They don't care that they give it on the up on D and you. And Keep up with us. Again with the bucket. Ooh, he's offense. piping hot. Four for four from the field. No one can guard him out there. Especially inside. You got John Wall. Mm, okay. Well, Devin Booker found his rhythm early. He's sustaining the Yeah, John Wall, Bradley Beal, Gilbert Arenas. I mean, all walking buckets. But then, I mean, Elvin Hayes and Wes on so. He's got 10. Play just field. crazy, man. Basket's mm. good with the assist from Wall. Another He's three. Six. The Wizards are literally just shooting and scoring. Yeah, well. from outside. Really in a great rhythm. Our is actually open with that screen covering. there. Pass to Nash. And he can't I can make it an extra pass, pass but I mean, this is what the... Wiz's philosophy is, man. Can you keep up Outside with us? Wall. 
and uh, they had kind of an open look there, and it turns out they can. Now that's unsettled <laughs> again. Taking a look at this first He's got eight points, man, just shown better in this shots first quarter. And I think All of them were scored in probably the most dominant and fashion possible. So Rim still Here's rattling Nash. over there. Uh -oh. Out left to the wing. From oh. downtown, knocks oh. down the long J. No, I will say this, the Sun squad is... Most efficient when Steve Nash Outside wall. is scoring. And again, it's Washington converting. They've, they've won plenty of games this season where Steve Nash didn't Could take a, a single shot. <laughs> uh, since like to the middle. he's scoring, Passed there's that much more deadly. The ball's loose. Oh. You see, that's the thing. This one team, they say they don't play the even. They focus on O, but... I mean, a good steal there, and then John Wall taking it coast to coast. Getting to the line. Or I'm sure they'll sink both of these. No problem. Yeah, this is a team that shoots, I mean... As a team, they shoot 95, 96% from beyond the earth from the free throw line. Yeah, we do have a platoon swap for the Suns, their entire bench. And so Wall nails is the in and for the Wizards. It looks like their entire bench is in. Except John Wall, who just took those free throws. I wonder if he'll come out now. No? Because he's he's looking to maybe take over the game. So he waves off the coach. Here's Kid. The jump hook. That won't go. Misses his first shot of the game. The Wizards with a lead. The kick out to Wall. Oh, wow. A chance oh, to push it surprisingly, to doesn't get that to mark. go. It was a long two, anyways. If he had actually been standing behind the arc, he would have had that extra distance and extra space. I feel like that would have went. Down low. They're not wasting any time putting their stamp. I love when a lot of this big man to big man. doing it largely at the offensive end. If the defense does not adjust, this could be a blowout. He was all alone mm -hmm. on that one. And both teams already firing on all cylinders. Yeah, this is already a high-scoring game, but we knew that was a possibility yeah, coming into this one. Here's Rulin. But no scoring yet from him, but that's likely to change. Oh, and Harris. Six the big the shoes as Michael Jordan retired oh, and there's the whistle this last the season. So two free throws for him coming up. But he's done pretty well, though. At the line for Washington. And he knocks down the first one. So he gets them both. And here in the first, they really are hitting their free throws. And it's yeah, they are both teams. 100% right point now. Game. Pass to Marion. But oh, stolen by Ooh. Harris. Another steal from this Wizard squad. This Sun squad has had the second best defense in the league. Past two seasons, and this Wizards team still putting up a 37-point quarter to the paint. Still going 70 percent from the four from the floor here. Here's Stoudemire. Now quiet so far offensively, searching for his first points of the game. Stoudemire does seem to be their go-to guy. Some falls for him. At the line for the sun. When this bench is on the floor. Taking two shots. So oh, one the first two free throw time. miss right. of the night. Comes from the Suns. John Walls waved the coach the off. Quarter of the game. To be out there and, and has missed he every shot since. Weak defense, but they just can't rely on him to miss those kind of shots. Johnson mm. with a bucket. Getting enough shots in close to play inside. You gotta wonder out. if the call was 
A That's minute a good four one. left to play in the first. Wall with a screen on Johnson. Tries the nine footer. Wall gets the bucket. I feel like when we're watching these games, people points. go and take over. I'll tell you, this lead's not going they have their worst performance. When they go and take over, they don't get the ball. And then when they do get the ball, they miss. And then as soon as they get out and take over, they score. On easy you know? two on the layup. Love to see that kind of activity. It just makes things happen. And so it's Washington with it. They lead by seven. Near here. Now here's Wall. They pass the Wall. Oh, good pump fake. Couldn't make him pay though. The wing. Near six is made the play. Here's Wall. This one they lost three. Again, mm. it's Washington converting. Oh, seven for John Wall. He's on fire. Yeah, I mean, Here's he Kidd. is. He's, Boy, he's been patient so far. But he's a good game, the I think. But seven of nine shooting. Johnson a screen on wall. Out to the wing. Here's Stoudemire. Oh, step. Another one falls for Phoenix. Okay. And so it's All right. Well, I mean, they're only down seven, but they are on the road. And this Wizards offense is not one that, that fades away, it's one that typically is stronger. So I'm going to stick with my original assessment. I, I think that the, the Wizards are going to secure this W. <laughs> A one-point victory for the Suns. What the heck did they do to come back from that? Well, okay, that, that helps um, as they were up one going into the half. And then another one going into the, the third quarter. So, I mean, holding the, the Wizards to 38% in the quarter is huge. Uh, and then 33% from beyond the arc in the fourth. Oh, my. So then they... Wow. <clears throat> so, first of all, this Wizards squad, typically, uh, I mean, wow. So, the free throws were exactly the same. This, this is what the Suns had to do to get a one-point victory. Over the Wizards. This is how dangerous the Wizard squad is. They had to beat them in fast break points. Points in the paint. Second chance points by double digits. Their bench had to outscore them by five points. They had to get nine more assists. They had to get, what, eight plus four, so 12 more rebounds. All right. Just to win by one point. That's how deadly... This wizard squad is 46% from beyond the arc is pretty elite as a team. Um, and you just can't help but think that despite that, right. You, when you look at that fourth quarter, like just, if just one more of those go in, that's their game, you know? So, I mean, let's, let's look at box score for both teams. John wall, 28 points, 12 assists, three steals, two blocks. Gilbert Arenas had 22 points. Bradley Beal even went 50% from the field. Like, it wasn't these guys that that were missing, you know, threes. Wes Unsell didn't miss a single shot all night. Um, Let's see. Oh, Phil Chenier uh, definitely killed him. I mean, you'd like him to go at least one of three. It, it's hard to blame a one-point game on someone. You know, it's one point. But then when you look at these guys off the bench, go one of four and then O of two from beyond the arc. Go two of seven and then O of two from beyond the arc. One of six. Um, granted, he got to the line a lot. He, you know, he, he did his stuff that way. Uh, Chenier, two of seven, O of three from beyond the arc. Like if either of these guys that went O of something from beyond the arc just made one of their threes this game goes the other way but it didn't because Devin Booker popped off for 31 points on five of eight shooting from beyond the arc Saramago had 18 points on the game Steve Nash still managed to get 11 assists while also scoring 14 points and yes while Charles Barkley was basically shut down by this wizard squad everyone else stepped up I mean, Dennis Johnson even had double-digit assists and multiple steals. And Najee 
who averages three points a game, doubled his average, went four or five from the floor, and still had 10 rebounds and a block, which is pretty much all he's there for is to get rebounds. Walter Davis didn't miss a shot. Charlie Scott didn't miss a shot. You know, Sean Marion didn't miss a shot. <laughs> Jason Kidd only missed one shot. Same with Kevin Johnson. I mean, so everyone stepped up top to bottom. Huge team win for them, despite Charles Barkley not having his best game. That, that's an interesting stat line to, to see, though, for sure. 